Atebo had three red slippers and two blue slippers. If two slippers are picked randomly from the table in succession, find probability that the second slipper picked is red. If they're picking oh, that, the that probability is. tree for the five slippers, R stands for red and B stands for blue. So in total, there are five slippers. Now the probability of picking a red slipper is three out of five because there are three red slippers and the total number is five. So it's three out of five. So when we pick a red slipper, there are maybe two red and two blue. But imagine you pick another red slipper from this. The probability will be two out of four because there are two red slippers and two blue slippers, which makes them four in total. So it's number of red out of total. That is two out of four. Now when we have picked this one slipper, we remain one red slipper and two blue slippers. But then, on the second picking, you could instead pick a blue. The probability is again 2 out of 4, because the total number of slippers is 4, and there are 2 blue slippers. So now here we remain with 2 red slippers and 1 blue slipper, because we are not replacing any we have picked. From the beginning, we could instead pick a blue. So the probability will be 2 out of 5, because there are 2 blue slippers and 5 slippers in total. We remain with three red, the same numbers here, but then the blue reduces by one, so one blue remains because we have not replaced it. So for, on the second picking, we could pick a red slipper. The probability of picking a red slipper is three out of four because there are three red slippers and one blue slipper, meaning there are four in total, so it's three out of four. So now we have remain with two red slippers and one blue slipper. But then again, in the second picking, we could instead pick a blue slipper. So, if we pick a blue slipper from here, the probability is 1 out of 4 because it's 1 blue slipper over the total number, which is 4. Now, here, when we pick a blue slipper, we remain with 3 red and 0 blue because there's only 1 blue and we have picked it. To put it practically, there are 5 slippers here in total. So, we remove 1. We began by removing a red move one red. The probability was 3 out of 5 because there were 5 in total and the red was 3. So now we pick one and remove it. Now there remain 4 slippers. 2 red and 2 blue. Then we can have a second picking. Imagine you pick a red again. We remain with 1 red slipper and 2 blue slippers. Now the probability of picking this red was 2 out of 4 because there were four in total, and by then there were two reds remaining. So imagine from the first picking, we instead pick a blue slipper. The probability of picking a blue slipper was two out of five, because there were two blue slippers and three red slippers. So two out of the total number, which is two out of five. Now we can pick a second time. Imagine the second time, we pick a blue slipper again. So now, the blue slipper, there will be no more blue slippers here and only three red slippers. And the probability of picking that blue slipper will be one out of four because there's only one blue slipper left and four slippers in total. So it's one out of four. But let's return the slipper. So imagine from the second picking, we instead picked a red slipper. The probability of picking that slipper is three out of four since there were three red and the total number of slippers was four. So now remain with only one blue slipper Solution. and two red slippers. The question asks us the probability if the second slipper picked is red. So we go back to our tree diagram. There are two options. You can either first pick a red, then a red, meaning that the second picked is red. Or you can pick a blue, then a red. Again, the second picked is red. So we get the probability of this along this line and then along this line like this. So now it's probability of RR or probability of BR. Probability of RR will be 3 out of 5 times 2 out of 4. Now this or means that we add the probability. Then BR will be 2 out of 5 times 3 out of 4. So 
that's 6 out of 20 plus 6 out of 20, which gives us 12 out of 20. We can reduce this by 4 to become 3 out of 5, which is our answer.